Hello, welcome to German class A1 lesson 18. Before starting the main discussion, I would like to share two facts with you. These lessons are based on my book German Grammar A1 to B1. Links to the video presentation of the book and links to other lessons are given in the description box. You can also watch other videos with the help of these links. I request you to please subscribe to my channel and many thanks to them who have already subscribed to it. Now let us move to the main discussion. Today we will discuss how the price of an article is written and read out in German. The German currency is called Euro, Euro and Cent. One Euro is equal to 100 Cent. Now, how the price of an article is written and read out is shown below. Let us take, <coughs> let us take for example this price. As you can see, this price includes only euro. You write it this way. First, you write the number of euro, in this case here 7, then a comma, and after that two zeros. And then you write the word euro, or you can also put the symbol of euro. You write, it, write the price this way, and when you read it out, then you read it this way, sieben, first to say the number of the euro, sieben euro, sieben euro. If the price includes only cent, as for example in this case, this price includes only cent, this price, is, this price you write this way, first you write a zero, then comma, and after that you write the number of cent. Here, in this case, it is 89. And then you write the word euro, or you put the symbol of euro. And you read it out this way. 980 cent. First, you say the number. 980, and then you say cent. 980 cent. Let us take another example as for example let us take this price we can see this price includes both euro and cent 7 euro 48 cent you write the price this way first you write the number of euros g7 then a comma and after that we write the number of cent 48 and then we write the word euro or we can also put the symbol of euro. We write it is written this way. And when you read it out, then we read it this way. Sieben Euro acht und vierzig Cent. First we say the number of euro, sieben, and then we say the word sieben euro, and then we say the number of cent. 48 and then the word cent. 7, 7 Euro 48 cent. Here, the price which includes both Euro and cent, in this case, we can also drop, we can also keep the word cent silent. That means, this price, 7 euro, 846 cent, we can read this price in uh, two ways. Either 7 euro, 846 cent, or we can also drop the word cent, and then we read it this way, 7 euro, 846. 7 euro, 846 cent, or 7 euro, 8 and 
so dear friends that was my presentation today in this context i would like to tell you that in my book german grammar a1 to b1 all grammatical aspects of a1 to b1 have been described in detail a brief description of the book and how to collect the book is mentioned in the description box finally i would like to request you to please subscribe to my channel so that when i upload the next video you can get the instant notification if you have any question you can also contact me my email address is also written in the description box and my cell phone number is also mentioned there i thank you once again very much thank you